next gen is actually an important generation because they're, they're the future. They decide what will be winning business ideas, losing business ideas. They're the consumers, the employees of tomorrow. I think it's, it's really interesting, it's inspirational. I think this is an excellent idea, an excellent opportunity to learn on what's happening within that specific niche or market. As I saw it, it is about the new generation of, of employees and that's important for um, all companies. If you don't recruit the youngsters of today, they're your consumers of tomorrow. So for me it's really important that we grasp what their needs are. Ladies and gentlemen, I wish you a warm welcome. We are very happy you're here. For the youngest, they have a philosophy, you could say. They're proud about the mistakes they make. I think whoever you are, whatever company you have, I think uh, you should open your mind for this. Who knows what TLDR stands for? Too long didn't read. It was interactive. One, two, three, four blues. All the rest is red. It's a bit like our soccer team. And you're all wrong, actually. Where you think you know the answer, you know, and that was the good thing with the lightning sticks. You still saw a lot of people starting actually from their own generation. Chatting is the new popcorn, you could say. All of a sudden you realize yourself that although you have a certain hunch, that those don't always coincide with what is generally happening. A commercial on YouTube, 7.3 million views in only a week. When you think of how uh, HR people, recruiters, can change the way they actually connect with the next gen, it's about, of course, finding new media, but it's also about self-empowerment. I want to create my own product. My name should be on it, and then it's good. Yuri has a way of bringing some extremes, but the extremes often make you open the path for growth and make you often think about well, what's next, what do I need to do, how do I take it into account for my consumers, for my shoppers, for my company. How could we face enoughism in the recruitment sector? No one wants to have the feeling that they're growing older. So one way of staying young is actually looking at your kids and imitating the behaviors. Uh, I think we all know about baby boomers, about Gen X, Gen Y, but how can you use that to your advantage? I think that's where a lot of trial and error will come in. It makes you think, and that's the main part and the most important part. You re did really a great job. If you look at the future with an open mind, then I think you will be ready for the future. Yeah.